Hello again viewers, Mark here again. Now, if, I, if there's anything I'm known for liking, it's mostly uh, Transformers Bionicle, the occasional My Little Pony, mostly for drawing, uh, Star Trek and Star Wars, uh, and the superhero genre, specifically Captain America Civil War, which I love. Uh, but that's besides the point. If there's one thing I'm also no for loving. It's a uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I'd like to show um that I have quite a collection with that as well. Even though my Transformers collection doubles that by miles. Yeah. Toy wise, I wasn't exactly much of a toy fanatic back then, so I don't have too much in the old department. But here on display, what I've got currently displayed here um are all four classic turtles from the cartoon and all four Nickelodeon cartoon turtles. The specific figures that aren't cartoon accurate. <laughs> the battle shell versions are, this is all I've got. Um, yeah, I was doing a photo shoot for DeviantArt and paying homage to a Transdimensional Turtles, an episode I love. Yeah, I've only seen series one, so I have missed a lot. So it felt weird, skimming head. But I'm, I am aware of certain events, but. Um, I'm mostly into the fact that David Tennant's voicing the f voice of the future toy. That's cool. Now, I'm also curious what happened to Leo's voice. The original voice is great. Why did they change it? Anyway, that's besides the point. Um, also, I'd like to show off some of my old, old stuff and sort of recent stuff. Uh, well, first off, we got well, definitely one of my oldest, uh, a Leonardo that you can transform into a regular turtle. In the UK's case, a tortoise. Uh, uh, second off, we got um, oh yeah, this uh, certain version of Krang. I've got. Took time for me to reassemble the parts. I've, I had to look for these in boxes in the cupboard. So it, it, it's still very hard for me to find his right arm. I still don't know why. <laughs> but of course, at least I found the window to keep his brain in place. Again, only Krang. Uh, um, this very old looking robotic version of Bebop this really misled me because I actually believed he actually became a robot in the cartoon at some point the brochure lied of course uh, uh, we got um, this odd looking bootleg version I think it's a bootleg version of Michelangelo I don't know why I've got this but it, it was sort of like a model kit, so because it, it was in pieces in the box. And of course, the the peg that held this midsection waist thing with the hole in the middle that sort of broke. So I'm tempted to glue that into place. I think it's I think it might be a boot legs. There's no licensing license print. Look at look at the black. I, I'm I'm suspicious. I'm suspicious about the fact that I might have done that <laughs> just to make him look. More fancy? I don't know. It's got this bike. Obviously, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle laid because hello, a half shell. Yeah, I think he was made for Mikey here, yeah, but yeah, again, no license. It's a bit of merchandise. A shell it says here as in a half shell, but that's not all. <laughs> Isn't that neat? Anyway, uh, we got. A really nightmarish looking version of Donatello with a pizza shooter. Yeah, again, I don't know why I have this, but it is what it is. Oh, well, I'm not going to demonstrate the pizza chewing. It's got three pizzas in there. I'm currently missing the fourth one. It just vanished on me. Well, basically, you pull on the left right arm here at the shoulder, they just launch out. That is, if you get it straight enough down there, that is hard. That's hard. They're not straight down there, it doesn't launch. Just gets stuck. Got this, this classic movie version of Raphael. Yeah, the, the original toy. Very rubbery. Don't know why. It's hard to stand because of that. Uh, uh, from uh, the reboot series, we've got a couple of blind bag figures from Fast Forward. And they were slightly reduced in the entertainer a while back, so I thought, why not? Yeah. Uh, this uh, particular one is uh, from Michael Bay's first movie, my only one, Donatello. 
I don't know why I never got the others in the end, but it's the version without the glasses and actually movie accurate goggles. The Art of the Shadow figure of Donatello has this weird visor thing. I don't know why. Uh, oh, and um, I'm sure that's all of them. Uh, finally, we have <laughs> from Mega Blocks, we have a love struck looking Donatello with a picture of April. <laughs> that cute. I was feeling as hard as I could, I wanted to get this one. Yeah, I've since learned that you can't have him hold the pitch too much because uh, this is this side's a bit too wide for the hand. I have no stress marks, so I'm gonna be careful in the future. Oh. There's the rest of them on this slip here. So Red Shredder, Mystery, K Krang, Foot Soldier, Donny again, Mikey with the pizza, Raph with spray paint, <laughs> and uh, Leo with one of his comics. Yeah, and this is the first series. I wonder what they'll we'll get for the, for the second series. And uh, DVD wise, we've got uh, the movie from 2007. Yeah, I personally enjoy that. Well, um, Turtles Forever with the uh, slightly inaccurate 87 Turtles. I've since learned from Phalus that it's not that light. I do, I do feel a bit guilty, but uh, it is what it is. Again, the transdimensional tools is way better, even though it's shorter. I mean, the A7 tools are spot on. Plus, I've got the original voice actors. How can you beat that? <laughs> oh, I've got the complete first series of Nickelodeons. So, found that in Scope, the cherry shop I do voluntary in. Yeah. I have to get seasons two and three one day. I haven't watched those yet. <laughs> oh, and I've got Michael Bay's first movie from my previous birthday. Totally awesome. Hopefully the sequel is a less awful tail based pun. Oh, and technically I've got a demo of a 2000, well, 2004 game on here. You, you, there's proof, there's proof. Anyway, as you can see, um, yeah, there, they all, there they all are, lying down there. And, uh, That's all, really. <laughs> so, uh, not much to say from this point. But, uh, I mean, these are the mod modern toys. I'm thinking of getting a couple from Out of the Shadows, but not too many. Maybe Shredder? I've had Krang has his flaws, which is a shame. It's one of the more interesting looking ones. And Shredder has nightmarish black eyes. <laughs> Anyway, that will do for now, and uh, um, hope to see you again another, another day. Yeah. Total power.